All right, uh, welcome back, everybody. Danny the Hero here again with another Minecraft video. Today, it's gonna be a little bit of a different video than you guys are used to. This is um, kind of me showcasing. Uh, it's not a showcase, but this is kind of me showcasing my own world, a world that I created with my girlfriend uh, months ago. Um, and this isn't wow. That's ugly. <laughs> This isn't, um, our world now. This is just a world that <clears throat> we made before and then the update came out and it wouldn't apply to this world. It wouldn't have ocelots, it wouldn't have jungles. Look at The update gave us these ugly grass. Ugh. Ding ding. Phone. Huh. Alright. Um, sorry. <laughs> Getting distracted already. So... The main thing about this world is that we lit up the entire thing. Uh, oh, wait, there's an ocelot! Ah, there are ocelots! We restarted for no reason! What the heck? Ugh, oh, well I don't have any fish, so... Um... Wow. I am... Alright, well... Anyway, this is the house. I made this house completely. Um... It looks very similar to the other house that I have. This is my Victorian style house. Uh, it looks very similar to the one I had in my other world. And that's because I pretty much copied it <laughs> from my other world. But I did change up some things. You know, I, uh, it's a lot bigger. Like, this thing is freaking huge. So let's go ahead. Also, this thing is pretty much halfway furnished. So we, we step in here. We have this wide open, like, lobby area. Nice little chandelier. Some chairs. We come over here. Fireplace. Very nice. Some books. Just kind of like a little sitting area. Some pictures. This is my favorite thing, the kitchen. <laughs> it. I, I think I did a pretty decent job with the uh, interior design in the kitchen. Oh, by the way guys, interior design work, not easy. Definitely not easy. Um, not easy at all. This is the backyard. Uh, kind of messy, but thinking about uh, cleaning it up. Well, not anymore. We don't play in this world, but. Oh. Um. Let's go ahead and go up here. This is the uh, upstairs area. I, I never really finished it. I started working on like a little potion area. So this is where I would do potions, some nether wart. Oh, right here, this is awesome. You can go up on the roof. <laughs> Yay, now you're on the roof. <laughs> We're gonna come back up here when it's nighttime so I can show you guys the torches. Um, yeah, this world, I don't know how many hours we put into it, but we put a lot, uh, a lot of hours. There's like a little bedroom. And look at this view by the way, like that you can't beat it. <laughs> you can't beat these views. We don't have an ocean side view or anything. By the way, I don't under I don't know what I was supposed to do with this. I think I was supposed to I don't know. <laughs> uh I I really wish I was able to finish this. It would have turned out pretty nice if I had. The basement I spent a lot of time on. I was actually in the process of expanding it all the way out that like this treasure room wasn't big enough. It was going to go all the way out there. We had the treasure room. We had a captured little slime down here, and it was Bilbo Baggins. Um, this is like a little fireplace area. I, I don't... I don't know what that is. <laughs> this was uh, our automatic wheat farm. It was malfunctioning, though, and I, I don't know why, but it didn't give you the all the wheat. The water would come down, like... Look at this right here. Oh, wonderful. You get one, two, three, four. It's like four long and it's uh, seven wide. Or, no, it's seven wide, seven long and four wide or something like that. So that should be 32 per thing. And I have two of them. So I should get two stacks every single little slot. This is supposed to be six stacks a week every single time. And for whatever reason, I was only getting like a stack and a half. So I was getting cheated pretty hard there. Um, this is my little melon farm. 
Just do that. Collect all the melons you need. Another reason why this world never kind of ended up working out for us was because it didn't have a stronghold. Here's our, uh, we, down there we had a, um, eh, I'll show you, whatever. It's kind of like our little strip mine, in a way. I mean, we never really got really sophisticated. Whoa, I see ya, I see ya. Come here, stupid slimes. We have so many slime balls, I don't even care. I'm just gonna kill it with a sword. Wow. Oh my god. <laughs> This is how I get high on the leaderboards, guys. Call me your slime. Yeah, alright, I'm not gonna kill him. <laughs> so, we... Like, this was supposed to be a huge basement. And we have some, uh... We have, like, actual... Wow! I, I'm getting ambushed! Alright, this is, like, our railway. And throughout the railway, we have, uh... Towards the end, we have, like, strips going down. Uh, so much time spent on this. I can't believe it's all for nothing, too. That's another thing that's, like, so depressing about the Xbox edition is that all of this is for nothing. Now, all the time. I mean, you make a world, and it's gone. Because you gotta stay up with the updates. I don't know. Eh, it's just the price you pay, though. Kind of stinks. Hard to commit to a world like that. Spend a lot of time here. Uh, I think it's nighttime now, so we're gonna go ahead and uh, check. Yeah, it's getting there for the night. Yeah, where's the sun? Does the sun doesn't set there? Oh, sunset's over there. Let's catch the sunset. Yeah, so this place didn't. It has a stronghold, but for whatever reason, there's no ender frame, and that you know can't go to the end with no ender frame. So I actually threw the little ender. I the ender and I it said oh you have a stronghold so I was like oh this seed's good and then I go over there and nope no stronghold kind of big disappointment but oh well so there's the sun setting and now you guys can see this is the work of my girlfriend Nicole this is absolutely unbelievable <laughs> like look at it and she did all all of all in survival with monsters on I mean that's just insanity I'm actually gonna go ahead guys and I'm gonna switch this to creative mode real quick I'm not gonna save it so don't worry um and I'm just gonna show you guys how much from a bird's eye view because this is look at you can see everything I don't know this is there, we never worried about mobs we never worried about uh nighttime never really worried about anything in this world which is kind of nice so I'm going to go ahead and load up in creative and I'll be right back. Alright, so I'm back guys and I have it on creative mode. And I took off the HUD so we can get a real good look at it. Yeah, so this is... <laughs> they are completely aligned on a grid. Every six. Look at that. And just to show you like an idea... Over there is not lit up. So, <laughs> this is, um, her goal was to light up the entire world, including the water. The water is lit up with glowstone. Um, we have this entire forest. Look at ice biome spawning in our backyard. Thank you, uh, Mojang, for updating ice biomes, because we really needed more. <sighs> This, this is why I gotta get out of that. I gotta get a PC that's really good and just switch to Xbox. Uh, switch from Xbox. Oh, we missed a spot over there. But yeah, look at the little desert we have over here. Completely lit up. This little area lit up. This area right here lit up. I mean, this is just... This entire mountain. I mean, you know how hard it is to light a mountain? I mean, well, not the entire mountain. But most... Oh. That's kind of cool. Huh, I didn't notice that before. I mean, and we also have... Wait, there's more. <laughs> we were going to build a giant castle here. Obviously, that's not going to happen anymore, because look at all the ugly. <laughs> this was all this color. And now it's... Oh, my God. I hate updates sometimes. They shouldn't affect existing worlds, uh, in my opinion. Well, in terms of biome changes. But look at this, guys. I mean, we never got it completed, 
But we are pretty damn far. I mean. Look at it. So yeah, guys. Um, I think we're going to pretty much call it here. I showed you all I needed to show you. My crazy OCD girlfriend and her torches. And along with my Victorian house. And... That's about it. I mean, there's not really much to show you. This house, uh, I can maybe do a tutorial on how to make somewhat of it. It's not an easy house to make, especially in survival. Uh, issues with it is that roof. I can't really zoom in. Well, maybe I... This is so unnecessary. Yeah, so right there, like that roof. <laughs> um... It's not easy to make, and like that roof right there, see I'll shoot it, like to have that comb over is really difficult, uh, and to have these all kind of even, uh, it's, it's just not easy to make these types of houses whenever you get to roofs, roofs are difficult, they really are, um, here let me show you the attic, oh, there isn't an attic, I thought we had an attic. Oh, I don't even want to replace it because I'm not going to save it anyway. Um, yeah, so. This is it. <laughs> this is the nothing else to really show. I'm sorry, guys. Uh, it's not a big world, but, I mean, time and effort were definitely uh, placed in here. And by the way, guys, if you have a world like this, you know, you have one kind of cool-looking house and maybe, like, a decent environment around. It's all clean and you can see a lot of effort. Go ahead and uh, show me it. And if you want me to film it, I will. If it's good, you know, like, if it's good like this, I mean, I don't think this is great or anything, but you see the effort in it. And, oh, look how ugly that is. The grass changed, and it changed the leaves. This is our little mailbox, too. Golden apple swiftness, too. Wow. Oh, I trapped the ocelot. Hold on. Oh, I can't tame him. He's in a trapped area. Alright, so anyway guys, I think I'm going to end it here. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Please leave a like if you liked the video and uh, subscribe if you haven't already. There will be more Minecraft content coming out. And uh, some more talk about PC Minecraft. I'm uh, highly considering buying a PC because I have some money saved away. Um, and yeah, uh, share this with your friends and uh, leave comments. I really like those comments. Uh, just, you know, let me know how I'm doing. Say I'm doing a great job. Say I suck. Whatever you want to do. <laughs> Alright guys, so uh, thanks for watching, have a good day, bye.